Alright, this is Watson, the electric jipe gym leader. He's starting out with the Voltor, level 20. And I'm starting out with Pyrovidon. Um, I don't know what moves this thing has because I've I've been using Cerebi. Let's go to Bulbapedia, why don't now, this thing does no rollout. Oh, but he's just going to use Spark. Now Um Specs? Nothing, nothing in this gym can do anything to specs. Like, literally, the only thing they can do to him is use quick attack. And in Voltorb's case, roll out. Which is why I started out with Pyrovision. I don't want him to get rolled out to death. Rolled out to death. And let's go... Erp. Oh, he's gonna heal, he's gonna heal. Might as well... Set up a reflect? Yeah. I mean, you gotta set up something when he heals. Even though he's primarily special. I think, I do believe he knows Sonic. Sonic BOOM! Oh, and he self-destructs, so that... That helped. The barrier actually helped a lot, or whatever we just used, Reflect. Now he's going on to his Elect Dyke. And... Yes, I just... I just said Elect Dyke. And I'm going to go out to Specs, because this thing can do crap to me! I mean, he can heighten his little attack all day, every day. But at the end of the day, it doesn't do anything. It does very minuscule feminine damage. I'm saying feminine damage while Specs is a female and just did like half. Well, Herb, Herb just grew a level. And Specs is about to. Now, he's going to go on to his Magneton and... I think this is his most hopeless Pokemon, because this thing is four times weak to my Sand Tomb. So if I can hit a Sand Tomb, please. I said, God, this thing will kill. Excuse me. Excuse me. Whatever this thing. It, it literally cannot do anything to hurt me. And it wastes his super potions. Because his last guy... It's actually kind of frightening. Not frightening. Threatening. Let's save these. This thing's, not, this thing's barely worth the time. Oh god. Um... We are actually go... Do I... Do I really not have any super potions? Wow. Whatever, I just healed off the Sonic Boom. I sh could have just gone for a fan attack. Whatever, I just overkilled it. Well, his last Pokemon, Main Electric, the evolved form of Electric, it is really, really good. But it can do very much to me. But I can't do very much to it. Especially considering that I do not have many more sand tombs. So here I'm gonna have to try to spam some bites. Actually, spamming bites seem to be a pretty decent strategy since it does the same kind of damage as sand tomb. Oh god! Wait, how did static paralyze when I used a special? Whatever, I have a paralyzed heal. And chances are this thing is going to try to paralyze. Okay, let's sand tomb. Use one of our last sand tombs. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Not done recording. I'm just finished in this fight. There's nothing I can do. To prevent this thing from just mowing my team down. Oh wait, it's poison. It's poison. Except Herb is just kind of dealing out the damage. And I want something to get experience. Oh. 
rounder. And rounder just grew a level. Oh, finally he learns a freaking move. Growl, we don't need you. Oh my god, rounder finally could do something. And Herb just grew a level. <clears throat> but there goes Watson. My teacher's named Watson. Not his first name, but his last name. Wahaha, <laughs> fine, I lost. You ended up giving me a, a thrill. Take this badge! I got money! <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <coughs> I'm gonna live, I'm gonna live. But did I know a bad Pokemon can learn Rock Smash? Use Rock Smash out of battle. And it'll make your Pokemon a little bit faster too. Hmm, you should take this too. That bear contains Shockwave. It's a trustworthy move that never misses. You can count on it. It doesn't do that much damage, but it is a pretty reliable move. Um, but I'm not going to teach that to anything quite yet. Uh, that was that was a pretty easy gym, considering the gym we just went to before. But the thing we just got from him, the ability to use Rock Smash, as I've said before, Rock Smash is among the worst moves in the game to use ever. For all time. Ever. So I'm going to try to find an HM slave off camera to teach it Rock Smash, because it is just probably the worst. It is. It is up there with Constrict. And. Pin missile for being the worst moves in the game. Oh, and healing wish. Healing wish is pretty horrible. Um, but yeah, I'll be right back. Well, I found something. It's not exactly an HM save, but it's a, it's a Firo. It is a Firo. There is nothing cooler than Firo in terms of flying types. Nothing. Oh, he faded. But in all seriousness, I'm going to find like a Paris or something. Something really, really retarded that I can just put Rock Smash on. Actually. Actually. You can learn Rock Smash. You're not retarded, but I'm not gonna use you, so. So, I'm going to learn Rock Smash right now. Everything can learn Rock Smash, but it is just so bad. Oh, oh, he already learned it. I guess he has, like, zero moves. That's actually, a de if it wasn't for Scratch, it would be a decent enough move pool. But we're going to use Rock Smash the old-fashioned way. We're going to go d deeply into our party and press this. When we can just do this. Oh, no Geodudes. Oh, well. But anyway, we're going to be venturing up here. Um, there's a news team we could fight right there, but I don't feel like doing that. And camper lady, I don't want to fight you ever. But apparently, I just get to fight you. Is there anything worth seeing here? It's a Sandshrew. I love Sandshrew. I love you, Sandshrew. But you're dead. Well, now you are not peppy. It's not that vicious. I mean, when you're facing a Tyranitar ever, you go through a much more vicious sandstorm. But here we are at the Mount Chimney Cable Car, a short walk arrow away. Are, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? 
Are you joshing me? Are you joshing me? Are you joshing me? I was an idiot and kept bloodshed on a match op. And so now bloodshed is dead. But anyway, we cannot go past here because there are some guys in the coolest villain costumes known to man. Hey man, is our leader really going to awaken that thing? Sounds like it, yeah, but I heard we need a meteorite to do it. Oh yeah, now, that's why the rest of their crew went out to Fall, fall Arbor. You got it until they come back, we're not going to let anyone pass, right? Right. What, the guy didn't answer the other guy's question? Well, whatever, we're gonna find something here, and it's going to be awesome. It's a- it's a Venonat. It, it, it's a Venonat. It's, you, you don't, what, what? You just, you can't, you, you can't. It, it is a Venonat. Everything you've ever said is invalid currently. Everything you have ever said to anybody is currently invalidated. I have one Pokeball to make this count. I prepared a speech for this moment. I was born in a log cabin, and outside was a Venonat. And I vowed one day I would capture a Venonat, and that day would be a very joyous occasion. And this, and right now, is a very joyous occasion for me. I mean, it is a Venonat. It is a Venonat. It is a. That's not enough words. Okay, I'm just gonna. Just go Every what I'm feeling right now. Back when you could put swear words in Pokemon names. Literally in Pokemon Black 2, I named my I tried to name my Absol Slut. Because I know Ab Absol is overpowered. And then I tried and it just didn't let me. I had to name it Slut Bag. Which I kind of been growing on that name. I've gr I grew on that name as time went on. But now we have the Rock Smash again, so it's always good that we have our little Teddy Ursa. I. I legitimately thought that was a Teddy Ursa. Like, I legit thought that was Teddy Ursa for a minute. It's not. It is a slack off. Good sir. Alright, Venona, even though you are legitimately the coolest thing that has ever. Oh, you're already in. I forgot what I named my small odd. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. That's amazing. Everything that happened is amazing. But I will try to make progress. I don't know why I went down here on camera. But I'll just meet you guys back where we were. Alright, so we're back here. We can't go through that desert yet. So, what do we do? You may ask. We battle a trainer. Come sing with me! Da 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 da! That is the worst heavy impression I could ever think of! And now I will be back! Alright. I concluded from this fight that Longbray is the most Mexican Pokemon there is. <sighs> if 
But we are here at the fiery path. I almost just said Ember Cave, because there actually is a place called the Ember Cave, I do believe. I think this is a decent enough place to end this off. So next time in Pokemon Emerald, we are going to be going through this fiery path and seeing what this encounter is. Alright, see you guys later.